Big Barn vlog and my mom's here obviously. You guys don't see her very much because she's normally like walking with kids but if I can get her doing something I'll get her doing something. Okay yeah. so this video is also going to be a voiceover so I got some coffee and I got a grande iced cafe mocha no whipped cream. Now we're arriving. I don't look happy but now I'm doing some stalls. Okay so in this video clip you can see me looking around in the shavings and it's really important and I'm glad I did this stall and videoed it because I actually found a salt block um even though this horse already has one hanging up so it was really good I found that because they could have injured themselves on it um now I'm just going around the edges to just see if there's any treasures that I need to look out for and then I'm moving the shavings back into place um and just kind of doing the stall and making it look nice after I take out everything. All right, there's Mr. Bud. I just finished my last of four stalls. Now we're gonna do whatever I have to do next. So I didn't really need to add this clip. However, I kind of wanted to just because, you know, I feel like not a lot of people realize this, but it is so much work when cleaning stalls because there's so much that goes into it because like yeah there's just so okay so right here i sped up a clip of me doing a little hay net thing um this is for lark he has a bit bigger of like the net part but it's kind of hard to even out the um hay you put in it so that's basically what i'm doing that's why you see handfuls of Okay, and also I struggled so badly with getting the zipper. It was not even funny. I was struggling so much. All right, so now I'm giving the horses that don't need hay nets just hay in the clean corner of their stall. Um, they all have different amounts, but for the horses that are there and are gonna be used for lessons still, I will give them their own personal dinner dish. Bud. Dinner? Want some dinner, bud? Here's some dinner, Kopi. Kopi, I gotta put it in. All right, enjoy your dinner. Beautiful, Sven's beautiful stall that I cleaned. Let's give him some hay. This is like one fourth ish, but I'm gonna give him some more. You know, whoever did this hay made a really big mess. I'm gonna give him a little bit more off camera. Hey guys, so you may be wondering why I said this was a realistic vlog. This is just barn chores that, you know, normal equestrians have to do. And it's kind of a look into like, you don't just ride your horse. You actually have to take care of them, give them food, water, do their stalls, all that stuff that's really important to maintain happy and healthy horses. I'm taking care of them. And this is what this vlog kind of is. So I hope you guys enjoy it. And if you're horse lovers, give a thumbs up. So here I am raking the um, pathway with the stalls and the barn. Um, I find it really nice to make it into piles and then just clean the piles up with a regular like fork you would use to clean a stall um, after you made like a couple piles depending on how long your um, like barn walkway is. So now you see me going and doing what I was just saying. Um, I personally know not a lot of people have barns that are connected like are like connected the way ours is but yeah that's basically what i do there as promised you can see my mom doing something aka grooming reggie so here i am washing off the rail um this really has to be done or else it would be absolutely disgusting um I did another rail after this, but that's pretty much it. It's not super hard, but it wasn't the funnest. I was probably contemplating my life decisions. Um, anyway, so basically that's all I did. It's really nice to make the barn look nice and neat, add to the aesthetic, when, um, especially when it's cleaner, it can do that. Um, everyone else was in the break room though, laughing really loud, and it did make me a little upset. Um, being the loner can sometimes not be the funnest of the barn. You're working all hard and when you need to go take a break, get water or something, they just, you can't relate to them and 
they all, it's just, it's just kind of sad overall, but obviously that didn't really stop me from doing anything. Just a little sad moment. Okay guys, so if you know anything about the barn that I'm at, you will know that there is two rails. Um, I cleaned one long rail and then obviously the black one that you saw. Um, I've been given a break, thankfully, because I'm sweltering. And then I'm standing right in front of the fan. I'm probably going to go visit the horses and then I'm turning out a horse. So, yeah. Welcome to the real behind the scenes of working at the barn. So here I am visiting Buddy. Um, the grass is a paid actor. And as you can see, he's a little bit, he's a little head shy. And I always spend a couple minutes with him, just, you know, letting him, like, get used to my presence being there. And then, most of the time, he'll let me pet him, he always made a scratching pull, and I don't push it either. Um, I love spending quality time with the horses when I can, so just enjoy some music and me and Bud. grazing I guess except it's Copenhagen eating grain pan grazing well he's eating his nice little munchkins and then we're gonna turn him out I figured them so I was able to get most of me grooming Copenhagen on a time lapse but um some parts I couldn't because he's being very impatient um but yeah enjoy some music while I groom Copenhagen Yeah, we can't do that. All right, guys, so I'm about to fly spray the barn's biggest little baby. And this is really just a show. No, no horse is perfect. He was misbehaving and being really impatient, but he's a normal horse. Anyway, I'm going to fly spray him, and I'll do you guys after that. Kopi was just let out. For the first time in forever, he was actually moving faster than a walk. Here again is my mom sweeping the break room because it gets very dusty and sandy throughout the day. So then I dumped out some water buckets to help out around, you know, being helpful. And then I put um, some bareback pads, uh, halters, and reins away. Yeah. And then we left the barn. Yeah. Right, guys thank you so much for watching that video i really did enjoy making it for you guys and i hope that it kind of just showed some of the things at, uh, at the barn that like no most people don't normally see if you just go for like lessons um i enjoy making the video make sure to follow my social medias and my mom's social medias and have a wonderful day or night